Hallelujah, glory to God. Welcome to Papa San Marita, bliss with Pastor Honorine. I have a prophetic word for someone. God says your prodigal was really ignorant, was ignorantly blabbering when they said you were not good enough. God says your prodigal was ignorantly blabbering when they said you were not good enough. This word is coming to someone you. You, you got a bad breakup and the person who left you told you you were not good enough for them. And it has made you feel like you are insufficient, like you are not enough, like you are, like there is something lacking. God says your prodigal was, was speaking out of ignorance. They really didn't know a thing about you. But God says the one who created you says is, is, is the one who knows exactly who you were born to be, who you were created to be. He says to the one who created you, you are the apple of his eyes. He says the one who created you, you are so important that out of more than 7 billion in people in the world, he knows you by your name. He has engraved your name in the palm of his hands that he can never ever forget you you he not even for a second he saw you are so important to him that he knows even the number of hairs that are on your head the one who created you decreed that you are you are the top and not the bottom you are the first and not the last he said you are a chosen generation a royal priesthood a consecrated people set apart for great things he said you are blessed beyond a curse he said you are lifted above every other thing above every other person to him you are a treasure he says you are a treasure to him. He says he has put eternity in your heart. He says you are that treasurable. You are that treasurable that even if you were the only one existing, he would still have left heaven. He would still have come to die only for your sake. He said you are so important that even if you were the only person on earth, he would still have died for your sake. He would still have given up his life for your sake. He would still have given up all the splendor of heaven just for your sake. He said he loves you so much even when you didn't know how much he loved you, even when you didn't have an understanding why you were here even when you were still feeling rejected he says his love has always been there and he will never forsake you he will never leave you nor turn his back on you, he says don't you for one minute let some other person tell you otherwise he says you are priceless he says you know your worth the worth of something is known by the price, by the value of the, or, or, or by the price that was paid for it. So the, the value of something is known by the price that was paid for it. He said you were worth his life. You were worth him giving up his own life so that you can be saved. That's how important you are to him. That's how valuable you are to him. So don't let someone who who doesn't who, who couldn't see how valuable you are. Don't let them determine how you look your, look at yourself, how you see yourself. They they didn't know who you are. If they had known, they would have been appreciating God for the privilege to be with you. If they had known, they would have been thanking God for the privilege to be with you. God says, don't look at yourself otherwise. Don't let anyone deceive you that you are not good enough. You are more than enough. You are a treasure to the one who created you. God bless you. Shalom.